gentlemen, the time has come for our co-main event of the evening. Two of the best featherweights in the country about to do battle here in the XFC cage for the Professional Featherweight Championship over five five-minute rounds. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He weighed in at 65.5 kilos and trains out of integrated MMA and Nitro Boxing. He holds a professional MMA record of three wins and two losses. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Jackson Small. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner. He weighed in at 65.55 kilos and trains out of Noak Martial Arts, holding a professional MMA record of four wins with just one defeat. He is the former WBC Queensland and WKA Australian Muay Thai champion. Put your hands together for Bevan O'Malley. And when the action begins, your referee in charge, Garth Harriman. Round one of this XFC featherweight title, five by five, Jackson Small and Bevan O'Malley. And I tell you what, if you did a survey of the crowd of what they pick would be the fight of the night or what they're most excited to see. I'm sure this would be the fight that most people would pick. I know Matt the promoter is really, really looking forward to this one. He looked like a kid at Christmas, didn't he, while <laughs> he, he was did. watching that? Yeah, he still is. Look, I'm looking at him now. O'Malley, clinical striker, 26 Muay Thai fights, 23 wins. One of the most decorated Muay Thai fighters to ever grace the XFC ring. Two amazing camps up against each other with no martial arts and integrated MMA and nitro boxing. Hold on to your hands. Mm. Look at that timing on the right hand there from Bevan O'Malley. Look how composed O'Malley oh. And small. And small. Flying knee attempt there. Almost turned into a I bit of I love the look on O'Malley's face. Yeah. He is so composed in there. Like you said, over 20 plus Muay Thai fights. Five in the MMA cage now. This is just another day in the office for Bevan O'Malley. Yeah, multiple Queensland champion, Australian champion, two-time Bangla Stadium champion over there in the motherland, Thailand. Oh, a Bangla Stadium champion. That is, that's uh, that's about as tough as they come. This is a classic matchup, though. With the boys from Integrated, not only are they fantastic strikers, they're very, very good when it comes to the grappling and the wrestling. All round, a great MMA gym. And the, um, the strides that Jackson Small has made in his last couple of fights is, is what has made this fight so uh, so anticipated. 100%, mate, especially his last fight. And when I was watching him coming out to his last fight, he looked very focused. And again tonight, he looks very, very focused with a very, very hard test in front of him with Bevan O'Malley. Look, this is uh, Bevan O'Malley. I think it's his sixth MMA fight. So he's no stranger anymore. It's not a Muay Thai fighter in there against a, an MMA fighter. He should be coming to his own now. So don't worry, he's got a few tricks up his sleeve. Yeah, well, like you were saying, even when uh, we saw that moment of uh, top position for Jackson Small, Bevan did all the right things, dug for the underhook, posted on the hand, switched his hips and got straight back to his feet. So, like you were saying, two MMA fighters in the cage now. 100%. Halfway through round one. Still feeling each other out. Not sure who's winning this contest so far. I want to see who's going to impose their will first. I like how creative O'Malley is with his striking. And the explosiveness is small at the moment. We're in for a cracker. Can't sleep on Jackson's kickboxing, though. Oh, look at the power. Look at the power he generates from his hips there. That's classic Nitro box there, those boys. Well, we hit Com hard. Compton's like, these guys, these guys are trained. 
And let's not forget that the XFC lightweight champions in Jackson's corner. So integrated looking here to lock up the lightweight and the featherweight XFC belts. Really great to see Isaac Hardman supporting the promotion again. Another clean left hand there. Jackson Small doing well on the feet. Perhaps better than someone would have expected. Staying very tight in the lads. Well, you touched on the creativity of Bevan O'Malley earlier. And when you're up, up against such a creative striker, you just you don't really know what's coming. So everything, there's just no room for error because Bevan will punish you if, uh, if he does spot something. Jackson Small really impressing me thus far. He's looking very good. Oh. Big flying knee attempt. And again, you've got to be careful with that in MMA. Doesn't always transition over. And Jacko nearly caught it. Looked to take him down, but Bevan did well. Pulled his leg out. Yeah, I think he was lucky there. Well, Bevan might have stung Jackson there with that leaping uh, straight right. Oh, wow, Bevan O'Malley. Comes in hard, doesn't he? Jesus. So entertaining to watch. It's only round one, lads. Look at the way Bevan O'Malley closes that distance. The speed in which he does it and how accurate he is when he does it. It's just methodical. Who's landing here more, though, lads? Look, this is a really tough round. He's got, oh, spinning elbow, Look, but big left. Caught. Big left hand lands there for Jacko. Oh, this is such a tough round to score. Boys give each other a glove touch. A lot of respect earned in that round, I believe. Seconds out, round two, XFC 36. Ball versus O'Malley. A vacant featherweight title is up for grabs. And what an awesome opening round. Jackson Small doing phenomenal in the stand-up. I thought he would uh, more have a, a wrestling-centric uh, game plan here, but he is more than holding his own and may well and truly have taken that opening round. Yeah, close. he looks really, really crisp. And I'm not sure how the judges scored it, but, yeah, yeah you might be right. He might have stole that one. Glad I'm I'm not a judge for that round. Look, when this fight was first announced, I was very, very excited, and this is living up to everything that I thought it would be. High-level striking in it. Very. Oh, big left oh. hand in the oh. 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 out! Unbelievable! Oh, my Jackson Small! Oh. That coming! Oh, what an amazing finish! The crowd is going up! Absolutely bananas! The crowd is on its feet. Oh my god. Jackson Small, the new featherweight champion of XFC, take a bow in the oh greater MMA. God. Who saw that coming? That was phenomenal! Ladies and gentlemen, watch this replay! Watch the setup here. Hands very, very low of O'Malley and just gets caught off guard. Oh, Big oh, left oh, hand. Wow. And he was out straight away. Jackson, right. oh, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, wow, wow. Integrated now has the professional featherweight and the professional lightweight in the bag. Congratulations. What an amazing performance. Unbelievable. Well, ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for these two featherweight warriors. Phenomenal sportsmanship there shown from Bevan O'Malley straight across the cage and shaking hands. But, uh, well, our referee has called a stop to this contest at 33 seconds of round number two, declaring your winner by knockout and new XFC featherweight champion, Jackson! Small! And a big thank you to Fighters Worldwide Clothing presenting that phenomenal featherweight title bout to us. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I don't know what to say. I'm here with the new XFC 
professional featherweight champion with one of the most stunning knockouts in XFC history. Everyone coming into this fight thought maybe, Jackson, you'd look to take it to the ground. You stood with him and, well, you closed the show with style points. Yeah, um, I just honestly just want to say thank you to Blair and Adrian Payne. Those guys have changed my life. The whole of Integrated Nitro team, all, all, the, all the boys basically, fucking Isaac, Craig, Nelson, Grego, fuck, all of them, fucking Jamie won, <laughs> Craig won, all of us, my, my friends, my boys, fuck my boys over there, my family, and um, I also want to say a special thanks to um, this woman, Danica, fucking, she's been with me since fucking day dot when I... When I first um, started fighting, and she's the most loyal fucking woman I've ever met. So I just want to just say thank you, and I love you. Well, Jackson Small, that will do for us, ladies and gentlemen. Integrated MMA go undefeated tonight, and our new XFC featherweight champion doing it in style points. Well, I think we got our knockout of the night sorted, Mr. Walton. Good luck topping that and the presentation of the championship ring. Just phenomenal stuff. One last round of applause, ladies and gentlemen, for your new champion, Jackson Small.